Is your logo application time or date dependent? Need to keep multiple PLCs time synced to each other? Here we will discuss and explain how Lavo's PLC's real-time clock, the RTC, may be easily configured to utilize this feature. The simplest way to set your real-time clock is by using the web-based management of your PLC. Just by entering the IP address of your device into a web browser and entering the login of admin and password WAGO, you have a lot of power at your fingertips. Go to the Configuration tab and select Clock on the left. Here you can manually select the time zone for the device, alter the TZ string to customize your time, change the time format, and modify the universal and local time and date for your device. If you want to automate the setting of the time and date on your PLC and keep multiple PLCs synchronized to each other, you may want to utilize the NTP client feature of your device. Click on Ports and Services and select the NTP client. Enable the service, enter an update interval, and provide an IP address of the time server that your NTP client will use. Click Submit. Now your PLC will request and set its real-time clock based off the time server at the interval selected. Wago also provides a way of programmatically setting the clock using a function block in eCockpit. There are a few functions in the Wago app time library that may be used to get and set the real-time clock. This may be important if you want to have a user interface to set the time date in your system. Or once set, your code can get the current time and date for data logging or event tracking. As you have seen, Wago provides great time features when utilizing the real-time clock and simple ways to set it up. Let us help you get in sync. Contact your local distributor or Wago's tech support to easily assist you.